Netflix Avatar live action series has even more confirmed castings. I made videos recently going over some mystery roles and there was a video around two months ago where I went over even more mystery roles. Some of those have been confirmed today and beyond that there's some new castings you've never heard about. This all comes to us from Avatar News. The first one is Rainbow which in the last video we went over I speculated that that was Katara's mom. Today Avatar News confirms that it is indeed Katara's mom. Our theories are correct. While we're on the castings of parents there was another casting for Katara and Sokka's dead and this is Joel who will be playing Hakoda. He looks very good. This is a very spot on casting. I am very happy with this and we got another mystery casting that was also confirmed. This one was announced two months ago. I had guessed it was either June or May and I thought it was June mainly because she looked older or it could have been May just because she had a similar expression and I'm happy to report that this turned out to be June which was also my number one pick. We're really getting these castings. She does look like June so it's a fantastic casting. I'm really happy with this. Now this has actually been out for a few months now but I decided to mention it since in the last video we speculated on a specific actor that could possibly be Jet, UA's fiance or Haru and this actor was confirmed as a mystery role by Night Edge Media. They brought it up back in April and said that this guy John is actually appearing in Netflix's Avatar series. To me he also looks like he could be Jet. So we've got two different actors. The way I see it the one we thought was Jet in the last video more and more people keep saying it's UA's fiance. I'd say that's probably number one pick. I'd say for the actor that we're on right now John I think he's probably gonna end up being Jet or Haru. That's my guess. Looking at him he looks more like he could be Jet 100% but I want to know what you guys think down below. What do you guys think of all these castings? Are you happy with them? When it comes to the trailer I probably see this coming out around October or November. I originally said September around that period of time but I've changed my mind due to a new report that's come out from the actor of Iroh. He actually came out and explained that they're going to be doing reshoots in September and that makes me think not everything's 100% ready so they're probably going to wait another month or two and then put out the trailer. 